I think it's fair to say that we'd like to add pitching. I think Chris is trying very hard to to add depth to not only our bullpen but to our starting pitching. And I don't know. I don't think we quite have a name yet, but I think it's safe to say he wants to add depth. How much did that mean to get also with Brantley done in the top three for him? I was I was glad because leading up to the end of the season, you know, I get a little try to shy away from maybe talking about some of that stuff as we're trying to compete for a spot in the playoffs. But I was a little disappointed that he wasn't getting more play. And you, know, you start hearing about other guys in the league, and I'm like, man, why, is, why are they not talking about Brantley? Well, evidently they were. People must have been listening because that was, that was pretty impressive where he ended up. And I thought it was very deserving. Have you talked to Swisher? Just want to, I mean, what house Text with him a, a, a lot. Um, you know, he continues to to try to hit goals along the way. You know, every week or so, there's something else he can do or at a more intense pace. Uh, and we'll, we'll, I'll see him, I guess the first time I'll probably see him is at, at Tribe Fest. And we're going to have to be very, not cautious, but very aware, you know, uh, cognizant of the fact that he had knee surgery and we want to give him a chance to be healthy so he can be productive. And we'll certainly keep an eye on him. But... We've had Joe Kessler, I think, visit him twice and James Quinlan to try to make sure that what he's doing is appropriate so he gives himself the best chance to be Swisher. He thinks that playing some outfield is easier. So, again, those are conversations we can have, but that's this in no way limits him to just DH first base. Well, he's made a lot of strides. Um, you know, he's a very uh, intellectual, you know, a little bit different, maybe thinker than some other guys. Um, we've tried to allow him to have space to, to have his thoughts and to just share them with us so we understand because we all we have one common goal, and that's for him to be the best pitcher he can be. And uh, he's been really good about sharing stuff with Mickey and, you know, understanding that, you know, you know we've tried to get him to command his fastball and work off of that. You know, he redid his mechanics a year ago, and that – Took a while, but for a kid that you know isn't real big, he looks very durable. You know, he he can he, he competes like crazy, and I think we think his better days are still ahead of him. He's still a young kid.